everyone, so today I'm going to be filming a what's in my purse video and I thought this would be a great video to film because I personally love watching what's in my purse videos and seeing what other people carry in their purses and I'm just going to be showing you everything in my bag and um, what I think is helpful to carry around in your purse, especially for the summer. So this is my bag here. Um, it was pretty cheap. It's from Forever 21. I like it because it looks a little bit more expensive than it actually was. I don't remember the exact price, but um, I really like this bag because of the gold details, as you can see. And you can button right here, but it's unbuttoned because I have a lot in it. And the gold zipper. So I really like it. And it comes with a attachable strap. So if you have um, a long day where you're going to be carrying your purse a lot, I would suggest attaching the strap so you can carry it over your shoulder, but I usually carry it with these two handles on the side here. So I'm going to open up my purse and show you what's in it. So here I have my wallet. I got it for Christmas for my parents. It's green, it's cute, it's festive, it's fun. And in here I keep all my cash, driver's license, debit card, gas card, gift cards, all that stuff. I try and keep it organized so it doesn't get too cluttered with receipts and extra stuff. So I'm, it's all organized now, so I'm trying to keep it that way. Next, I have my checkbook just to keep track of my money, my balances, how much I have to spend on my card, and so forth. Next, I have the sunscreen. It's Neutrogena brand, as you can see. And it's SPF 70, broad spectrum, and I really like it. It's for the water, and so if you go to the beach, it stays on pretty well, as it says here on the front. And I just tried this this weekend when I went to the beach, and I went out on my boat, and I really, really like it. It works well, it's not greasy at all, and it smells amazing. It smells like kind of fruity, citrusy, a little bit of like, flowers sort of, I guess, but I really, really, really like this brand, so I would definitely suggest it. I'll show it to you one more time so you can see. That's what it looks like, so I would pick that up if I were you, because it works great. Next, I have these makeup wipes here, and this is for sensitive skin. It's oil-free, and it removes waterproof mascara, and there's 25 in this pack. This is what they look like. I got mine at Target. I really like these just because if I'm going to the beach or something or to the pool, I can quick wipe off my mascara before so I don't have um, mascara running down my face after I get in the water. And also if it's just really hot out or after I exercise and I don't have time to go home and wash my face or shower, I like to just wipe off my face because um, I usually don't wear face makeup, like foundation, unless um, it's a special occasion. So um, it's totally, a great thing to use if you don't have face makeup on because it just is really refreshing and so I like to carry these around with me. Next I have this cute little pouch here where I keep kind of my cosmetic stuff, lotions, etc. So this is it. It's cute. It says if the crown fits, wear it. Such a diva. Anyways, in here I have bug spray because summer, it, if you go to bonfires at night or whatever, um, there could be lots of bugs and mosquitoes. So I recommend carrying a little spray bottle with you. I didn't buy this. I filled it up myself with some just normal bug spray that you get at the store. So I like to have this in case I get attacked by mosquitoes because that seems to happen to me frequently in the summer. <laughs> Next, I have this little Essie Spa Manicure Lotion. My friend gave it to me but I am planning on getting more when I run out because it smells great. It's not an overwhelming scent, so I just really like it because it's calm, it's mellow, and I just really like the Essie brand, so I would definitely get this if you can. It's from Target and it's pretty affordable, so I definitely recommend that. And then also in here I have two hand, sanitizer, hand sanitizers, I guess. So. These are both from Bath & Body Works. I usually do the five for five deal because who wouldn't? It's, I love cute little sanitizers and it's such a good deal. This one's Island Margarita and this one is Sugar Maple. So this is more of a wintry scent. That's why I've kind of stopped using it, but I'm still carrying it. 
And then the Island Margarita one is really summery and fresh and I love the scent. So I always carry um, hand sanitizers in case, I don't know, just like to have them. I have a couple nail files because I usually get my nails done. I got them done today. So they give me files when I'm done. So I have those. Another little file. I usually carry a little comb in my purse in case my hair gets tangled or I want to redo it and sometimes when I'm pulling it up in a ponytail I like to comb it so it's flat on the top. So there's that. I have another lotion from Bath & Body Works. It's French Lavender and Honey. The bottle looks like this. And I really like this scent too. It's really calming. Whoop, something that kind of spilled out here. Anyways. Yeah, I really like this, and it is loaded with vitamin E, as it says on the front, and yeah. So, I also have a couple hair binders, because, I don't know, can never not have those, I guess, on hand. And then I have my Victoria's Secret Night Body Spray, and I love this scent. It's very mature, and it looks like this. Sometimes I carry around different Victoria's Secret perfumes, like I have the Bombshell one, and also I think it's Heavenly, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called, but I really like this one because it has a very citrus uh, smell to it, but it also kind of has more of like a masculine scent, if you know what I mean, so I really, really like this. I would recommend getting it. I w have wanted this perfume for the longest time, and I finally just purchased it like three weeks ago, so I'm really happy I did that. And then also in here I have my EpiPen because I have a peanut and trina allergy that's really severe so I need to have that at all times but obviously not everyone would carry that around. I have a pen in my purse, it's from the Beverly Hills Hotel and I just like to carry it around in case I need to uh, write a check, um, sign, sign a receipt, something like that so it's good to have. I found a little EOS. EOS. I never know which it is, but anyways, these little egg lip balms. And this one I think is Honeydew Melon. And I really like this scent. Next, I have a crispy rice bar with chocolate. It's from, I believe, Trader Joe's. It's gluten free for all of you guys who are gluten free like me. And um, it's low sodium, only 110 calories. Looks like this, has the little koala bear on the front. So yeah. Oh, this is important. So I'm also carrying Airborne in my purse now. If you don't know what Airborne is, they're these little vitamin tablets that really boost your immune system. And I promise you, these work like a charm. If you know you're gonna be going on a flight, to the amusement park, somewhere where it's kind of germy, take one before and after and you don't get sick. Even in the winter, if you're around someone who's sick, take this and um, you probably won't get sick. Or if you feel yourself starting to get a cold, take one of these, it'll probably work. Zap the little virus. So definitely have these on hand at all times. Looks like this. You can buy them, I think, at pretty much any store. Just ask whoever's working there if they have it. And yeah, I definitely, definitely recommend these. What else here? I have my headphones. I cannot leave the house without my headphones because I like to listen to music in the car when I'm not driving, obviously. And just if I'm sitting by myself somewhere, I can just listen to music or if I'm walking, whatever. I have some Kleenex in case this is especially good for allergy season or cold season to have these in your purse. And lastly, I have my sunglasses, aviators. Yeah, so these are my favorite sunglasses. I like the way they look on my face with my face shape, so I always have these on hand. And that is it. There's nothing left in my purse. So I hope you guys really liked this video. Um, give it a thumbs up if you did. And uh, if you have any suggestions for videos, leave them down below. And I would be happy to consider those. So 
that is what is in my purse and I will talk to you guys later with another video.